Hi there, everybody. In my details today, some new data just coming in from a European agency calculating the temperature around the globe. No surprise, 2023 was the hottest year on record. It was the fifth hottest year on record in the United States. In fact, over the last decade, most of the years have been record hot here, not just in the United States, but around the globe. And some new data from Climate Central indicating and showing that these hot, record hot years are really starting to cost us. And here's what I mean. The number of billion dollar disasters in the United States has skyrocketed over the last several decades, really over the last 10 to 15 years. In 2023, the United States had 28 billion dollar disasters, which includes storms, heat waves, droughts, that kind of a deal. The previous record was 20 back in 2022. So that is quite the increase. And what is troubling is that the amount of time that is spent between these billion dollar disasters in any one year is starting to shorten. In the 1980s, there was a billion dollar disaster in the United States about once every 82 days, about three months or so. In 2023, we had a billion dollar disaster every 12 days. Days. That is just incredible, and that's where the costs really start to add up. One of the reasons why insurance rates are going up in places like Florida, because there are just so many storms affecting us. Now, previously, these billion dollar disasters were made up of things like heat waves and droughts, but more and more new data is indicating that these events are really linked to storms, intense storms fueled by a warming planet. In 2023, more than 60 of these events, of these billion dollar disasters, the majority of them in fact, were caused by severe storms. And the storm that we had earlier in the week rolling through the United States may be our first billion dollar storm of the year with tornadoes across Florida, flooding across the East Coast, and then numerous rain and snow events across the Rockies as that storm was moving through. A data indicates that as long as our planet continues to warm, these storms will become more intense and we'll see more and more of them in the future.